Now to pushing for a new plan. A coalition of San Diego County businesses has been rallying for the past weeks for a better reopening plan. And new tonight, they're taking the next step, asking as many businesses as possible to sign a petition on the group's new website. Fox 5's Kasha Gorchik joins us live outside the county administration building with all the details. Kasha. Good evening, Kathleen, and this is not just any petition. The group We Mean Business is actually calling it a contract, and they're hoping to show the county just how many other businesses are on board with creating a safe way to help more businesses reopen and a way that will benefit a lot of these businesses that are really struggling right now. Currently, there's no green tier. Currently, there's no light at the end of the tunnel. Frustration has been building among small business owners for months now, adjusting time and time again to the state's changing guidelines. The latest, a color-coded system with even the best level, yellow, signaling a slow return to business as usual, only allowing 50% capacity for most industries. A restaurant or a business or a gym that is kept at a limited capacity is not going to survive. John Weber, owner of Cowboy Star Restaurant and Butcher Shop, started We Mean Business as a way for businesses to join together after experiencing his own tumultuous ride on the reopening roller coaster. In just a few short weeks, dozens have rallied and now hundreds of businesses have hopped on board signing a contract on the group's new website. It's our commitment to the county to say, look, Small businesses are doing things right. We understand what needs to be done. We are following all the protocols and we don't feel that the direction we're going is going to ever get us to a point where we can fully uh, be open. The next step involves getting county supervisors to meet San Diego businesses halfway and come up with a plan for reopening everyone can agree on. There's a lot of people's livelihoods on the line and it should be understood that, you know, they call them purple tears and red tears and, and, and orange tears, but they're people's lives really. And we mean business is currently in talks with county supervisors trying to set up a meeting here in the near future. In the meantime, they are hoping as many small businesses across the county as possible can sign that contract up on their website. If you are interested in learning more, we do have a link up on our website. Just click on the scene on tab. Reporting from downtown, Kasha Gregorczyk, Fox 5 News.